welcome WBP stars. Uh, I'm Olli Schuiling and welcome to the kitchen from the restaurant Castile Heemstede in Houten. The last dish we're gonna make is a dessert and not a normal dessert. We're gonna make a dessert uh, which every compono uh, component uh, is uh, based on black olives. Black olives, uh, everybody knows olives from as a starter or with a little bit of piece of ham, but in the end olives are very, very sweet. And if you dry them on the right way and you use the right olive, you have a perfect ingredient to make a perfect dessert. So we're gonna make a dessert out of it. In the end, these olives, uh, we dry them and of course I prepare them uh, already a little bit because it's gonna take uh, two or three days. And after you dry them, you're gonna make you're gonna get like a like a powder of it, and this is in the end the ingredient for the whole dish. With this powder, uh, we're gonna make a, a cream. So um, I prepared like a soya coconut cream. So you have to stir up a little bit of lumps out because there's no cream in or no cow. Uh, yeah, no lactose, in. so it's also uh, lacto-free. So that's in the end um, the cream. It's like a creme anglaise, but then with coconut and uh, soya milk. And then we're going to add this dried olive powder. And also these kind of things, yeah, we like it to do it a la minute. Because otherwise the black it's um, the cream that's black and I want it to have a little bit uh, let's add a little bit more because it's so tasty. So that's in the end the first step. Coconut olive cream, very sweet and very tasty. The next thing uh, we made and it's uh, in the end, uh, the technique of making an uh, M&M, and uh, it's a dragée. They call it. Uh, it's a French technique. We caramelize some uh, some pine cores, and then we melt some chocolate and add um, uh, a few ingredients. And the main ingredient is, of course, again the uh, olive powder. What I always do when, when I work with uh, chocolate is add a lot of salt. I think we use in the desserts uh, even more salt than in the main course because. Uh, for me, desserts are always too sweet, and I like it to combine salt and sweet, and in this case, also creamy. Then, another thing we made is like a, a bowl, and I will break one for you to show the effect. It's like a bowl with um, um, a juice uh, made out of black olives, and it's basically very simple. We juice olives, and then we add red wine vinegar and olive oil. and. Uh, it's like a vinaigrette with uh, yeah, olive oil and red wine vinegar and of course uh, the black olive juice. So that's also a component. Other component is um, yeah, it's a crisp. Also made with uh, it's also very crunchy again. It's uh, three kinds of sugar. We use um, cotton candy sugar in the end. Uh, we use some glucose uh, syrup and some fondant sugar. We cook it to 160 degrees, and then at the end we add also the dried, uh, yeah, the dried olive powder. Then we make a powder of it and uh, we bake it, and we get this small caramel chip. What is getting uh, very, very crispy. So that in the end uh, are the main ingredients. So everything on base of uh, olives. Um, to add more olive taste, we also have, and it's olive oil ice cream. It's in the end a classical creme anglaise, but we add at the end of the process, we add a very virgin olive oil, um, which is very tasty, and you get a, a nice creamy olive taste uh, in the dish. So now we're gonna start with uh, plating the dessert. In the end, uh, it's a very easy way of plating because uh, it's a very natural uh, looking dish. We start with uh, the cream with some uh, olive oil. Or black olives. Then we have the wall with the liquid uh, center. I put uh, a little bit uh, because it's a dessert and it needs a little bit of vanilla. So we put a little bit, it's like a creme anglaise with a little bit of mascarpone in it and some vanilla and of course some citrus because then we have, uh, let's say, the M&M's or the dragées from uh, olive and the pine cores. 
and it gives a really salty touch uh, to the to the plate. And also here we don't use too much ingredients because I like it if people can count the taste. Then we add the olive oil ice cream. And in the end, let's take the nicest one I have here for the camera. We add the olive oil and black olive chip. So this is my dessert with uh, black olives. Black olive cream, olive oil ice cream, dragées with black olives and olive chip. Please enjoy.